Romans. Four banquets. Four hundred courses. Yes, it's Roman come dine with me. And tonight, it's teenage emperor Elaga Balas' turn to cook for his guests. But the young emperor's reputation has some of his guests nervous before they even arrive. Yeah, I'm a bit scared, to be honest. I mean, apparently, Elaga Balas is a bit crazy. Like, a friend of mine was invited to one of his feasts, and he made them eat live parrots. I mean, imagine trying to swallow all those feathers. It makes you sick as a parrot. <sighs> so, how is the potty prankster planning to impress his guests tonight? Well, tonight I thought I'd just do something really easy. It's easy because I'm not making it, my slaves are. <laughs> what are you cooking? Well, I'm going to do camel's feet with a, a scooped out flamingo brain and uh, some nice stuffed snails. Then we've got the sow's udders, got the jellyfish. Uh, I'm going to do a dormouse, which is rolled in sea. And I've got the jackdaws, I've got horse meat sausages, and uh, rotten fish guts, and of course, peas with little nuggets of gold. That sounds like a really nice starter. What's the main? Agrippina is the first to arrive, and there's a shock in store. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tread in those. Those are the guts of some people I had sacrificed earlier. Ugh. Yeah, they're to tell the future. And the guts say... My pudding is going to be so scrummy you won't literally believe it. Alagabalas goes to check on the food, while the rest of his guests have a snoop round the palace. I wonder what's in here. <gasps> no, 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 don't go in there. Please don't go in there. Oh, come go on, there. come on. <laughs> <laughs> Rock hard. That's because it is rock. I gave you both bits of wax and stone that are made to look like food while I get the real food, which is actually really nice. Mmm. How mad am I? How mad am I? <laughs> Eat it. <laughs> Time for some scores. Well, I slipped on human guts, I uh, was attacked by a lion, and I was forced to eat rocks. So, I'm going to give him a two out of... If you give me a bad score, I'll have you executed. So... So, I'm going to give him X out of X. Sweet! And I got you a doggy bag, because I'm so generous. Thank you. It's an actual dead dog. <laughs> I'm so random. Stay in touch, yeah? That's 100% accurate. Elaga Balas really was one extreme prankster. I mean, hiding lines around the house. What's wrong with good old itching powder and whoopee cushions? <gasps> oh, that wasn't me. That was Marcus, my pet flea. It's like an all-in-one itching powder and whoopee cushion. <laughs> oh, Marcus! Oh, I do apologise. <laughs> 